What's up, how's everybody doing? Welcome back to the channel. All right, guys, jumping into another episode of Making Moves. Uh, this episode is probably going to be about, you know, who should I put at my cornerback three, even though I really hardly come out in a, in a nickel set, but, you know, you guys seen the card that I got in my last uh, pack opening video, uh, the Braylon card. I'll show you guys right now. Uh, the, uh, what his name is, B Bashard Braylon uh, from the Redskins. And uh, you guys were like, Cooper, go on and throw him in the in the slot. Some of you guys were even saying start him over to leave, and that shit ain't happening. <laughs> you know what I mean? He can go in the slot, you know what I mean, all day long. But uh, he, he definitely ain't taking to leave spot, you know what I mean, uh, to leave pretty much uh, boo-boos on him in, in, in every category. Uh, but, you know, he's definitely a good card. Uh, I'm 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 kind of leaning more towards selling him for the coins, but we're gonna talk about uh, these guys' stats. Uh, I'm probably gonna put one of these guys on the auction block today, and I'm going to put I got another card that I got out out of that pack opening. Um, Evan Evan Mathis, I believe, uh, we're gonna put him on the auction block, uh, and I looked at his card on Mudhead. And I mean, it, it was showing that that card goes for a good amount of coins, so I'm definitely excited uh, to put that card up. But like I said, right now, uh, this video is mainly going to be who should I keep at cornerback three. First off, uh, Prince is taller. You know, Prince is faster, uh, has more acceleration, uh, awareness is pretty much the same. You know, we're just looking at the base stats right now. Uh, Braylon has has more agility, uh, better man coverage, only by one, and zone coverage, uh, he got him by three. Uh, press, I really don't press a lot with my corners, but okay, the biggest one that I seen when I did like a, a, a quick little once over before I started the video when I looked at, at the two cards, uh, just so I can explain them better, is the play rec. Uh, Prince only has 77, and Braylon has 85. You guys know how much I love pl play rec. That's a big stat, man. That that stat is huge. You know what I mean? And, and for Prince to only have, I didn't even know he, he, all he had was 77. So I was like, God damn, you making all these plays, all you had was 77. Uh, but a lot of that had to do with uh, the stats that I'm about to tell you about Prince is his uh, 68 strength. Very, very important when it comes to block shed. Braylon only has 57. Now, this is something that you guys uh, tried to bring to my attention, you know, telling me, how much block shedding, you know, Braylon had. Because you guys know I love my block shed. I don't like to get ran on. I like my cornerbacks to be able to get off them damn blocks. You know what I'm saying? That's why receivers are trying to put on them. And I must say you guys were correct. He has 67 block shed. That, that's damn good for a cornerback. Not too far behind is Prince. Prince was 66, you know what I'm saying, which I already knew. Like, that's why I, I, I got him at my cornerback um, three. So he has great block shed for a cornerback but let's go back up to the top what I was just pointing out the strength uh, if you guys did not know uh, strength g gives you a boost with your block shed I mean gives you a big boost with the block shed with with Braylon strength only being 57 he's he's not gonna be able to get off most of the blocks that Prince w would be able to you know what I mean all right Good example. I just went went up to uh, Richard Sherman, you know, on on the right. Richard has 78 strength. All right, I'm just I'm just trying to prove a little point here. 78 strength. Uh, you guys watch my videos. You you guys see how well Richard gets off blocks, but he only has 58 block shed. You know that's not a lot, but his strength makes up for that. His strength boosts you know that 58. Uh, to, to, to something, you know, off the charts. And he just, he just block sheds like a man. He's also, uh, run stuff chemistry. You know, you guys know one of my chemistries is run stuff, but I, I, I think it, like, I, I done tested this theory out with other cards, uh, not ha having the run stuff chemistry and, and they perform the same way. Believe me when I say strength plays a humongous part in block shedding. You know what I mean? Uh, that's, that's linebackers, defensive line cornerback safety all of the same you know what I mean you got to have strength when uh, you're looking at the block shit so that's Braylon's biggest knock right now like I, I don't think he's going to be able to get off the blocks as quick as Prince Prince uh, can 
So they're, they're pretty much jumping the same. Um, but I really like this stat that Braylon has, the 90 pursuit. That's that's crazy. That's out of this damn world, bro. For a card that have that much for a excuse me, I, let me correct let me correct myself for a cornerback to have that type of pursuit. That's that's crazy. That's like safety pursuit right there. You know what I mean? Uh, so as soon as he gets off the block, if he can get off the block, you know he's gonna take the perfect angle at whoever has the ball. I was that's something that that I really, you know. Was was thinking about you know when I was thinking about like oh, which which one of these guys uh, do I want to keep on the team? Uh, I mean, in a perfect world, guys, I can keep both of them. You know, in, in a perfect world, unfortunately, we got to make us some moves. You know what I mean? We just we can't keep everybody. We did it right there. What's the point of the series? You know what I mean? Like we we got to make the tough decision. You know, uh, both both cards are are very very well suited for my team. I'm lost. I'm lost. I don't know what the fuck to do. <laughs> That's not me. I, I, you look got a plan, baby. I don't know what to do. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I tell you guys what. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna see how much that Evan Mathis card is going for at first, and then we'll come back to seeing who we want to keep for our cornerback three. Look at this. That's crazy. It's not even a lot of them on on the auction house. Like, this is how much it was saying that this car was going for on Mudhead. This is ridiculous. I mean, how lucky of a pull was that, guys? You know, looking back in retrospect, this car is going for 80000 That's crazy. I'm going to put mine up for probably about, mm, probably 77 77K. I think that's a, that's, that's a good fair amount. Uh, this guy right here got his stuff up for 125 I you know, that's, that's just too damn. I don't even think the uh, 99 sitting, because I'm pretty sure this car goes into that sitting set, that uh, 99 overall sitting uh, set. I, I, I think that set only goes for, what, two, two, 300K or something like that? Why would you pay 100? I mean, even though you, you can see that there's not a lot of him on, on the auction house right now. There's only three. So that was a that was a damn good pull. Guy. Probably one of my best pulls thus far this year. You know, that was that was clutch, man. Evan Mathis, <laughs> the million dollar man himself, <laughs> gonna put you up real quick, brother. You gonna go fetch me some coins. Whew. Look at that number jump. Look at that jump. Mm. Look at that jump. Jump, 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 jump. <laughs> I love it, guys. I love when that never jump, man. That's the best feeling in the world. That means you winning. You winning without even playing the game. Uh, should we put him seven, seven? You know what? Might as well. I mean, what's 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 another five hundred? You know what I mean? They can deal with it. There we go. There we go, guys. All right. So we got that card all knocked out. Now we need to see uh, which one of the cornerbacks we want to sell. We'll check um, Braylon first. See what we can get from the young gentleman. Hold on. What? I, I, did, did, do, do my eyes deceive me? I just seen a a crazy amount, like a hundred thousand, but. I know that was it was probably a little off. Okay, so we can get we can get like thirty thousand from the from the young whipple snapper. That's pretty good. That's pretty that's that's a pretty good lick right there. All right, let's uh see how much we can get for Prince. You know, and this is, you know, a big part in the evaluation of who who we want to keep. Alright, so we get a we can probably get about thirty six for uh well damn they are <laughs> Uh, they buying this card up. I mean, I might need to go and put him on, on the market quick. I mean, if, the, if if he's the one that I want to get rid of. So yeah, we can put him up for about thirty six. Get about thirty for Braylon, thirty six for Prince. You know, both cornerbacks are um, pretty similar. You know what I mean? They have a certain skill set. So let's see. We'll we'll go back. You know, saying to the screen, and uh, we'll figure this thing out. All right, guys. Well, here's the two contenders. Um, very good cards in their own right, but somebody got to go. I can't keep both of you. That's really going to make make the uh, choice. This how I'm gonna do it. You guys thought it was gonna be a scientific way? Hell no. It's gonna be any man and mine and mo. Ketchup. Nah. I, <laughs> I think it's gonna be Braylon, guys. 
I think we're gonna get rid of Braylon. Um, it just, it just, it just seems like you know, he's he just seems like the odd man out on the team. Um, you know, he's he's obviously shorter than everybody else. That's 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 a big deal to me. Um, his block shedding is great, but his strength isn't uh, on par with 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 the rest of the guys on, on the team. You know what I mean? To really get off those blocks the way I need a guy. Because that, that half a second be, between him getting off a block because he's not strong enough can be the different, difference between somebody breaking a five-yard run or a 25-yard run. You know what I mean? Uh, so I, I, I need every advantage that I can get. And uh, I, I just I just feel like he, he, wouldn't, he wouldn't mesh well. You know what I mean? How do I? All right, guys, here we go. Got to sing y'all, young man. That was the most uh, thought-provoking investigation, explaining whatever you want to call it, that I had to do for 30, 30K coins ever. <laughs> I mean, I really, I really went in on trying to see which one of those cornerbacks I wanted to keep. I really did not know because both of them are very, very good cars. You know, I, I would recommend in any person you know building a team right now if if, if your coins are uh aren't the highest you know and you need a pretty good cornerback definitely pick up Braylon. he's not a bad car that's, that's why i had to think about it so hard all right so i hope you guys enjoyed uh this right here was a very very fun video for me to make uh you know comparing stats and you guys know I, I love doing that stuff uh so definitely hope we can make more videos uh like this in the making moves series uh also what I'm I'm thinking about doing I'm thinking about doing a flashback uh pack pack opening for you guys. You know, I mean I have enough coins I could buy the elite badges, which you know, yep, one of the cards just sold right there. Uh that I I, I could, you know what I'm saying, go, go on and acquire those uh th those badges. Uh, I think they go for around thirty K or something right now. But uh I I need you guys to let me know, you know, down in the comment section and probably with likes on this video. You know, I mean, if this video gets, let's say, eh, 500 likes and, you know, a good amount of comments, you guys let me know. Yeah, Cooper, do a flash pack, you know, opening or whatever. Because, you know, they just released some new flashbacks into the game. Uh, you know, you got the Tlaib, you got uh, you, you got the Vincent Jackson. You know, you guys know I want that card. It's so bad. I mean, they just got a lot of great cards that, that, that I definitely can, can see myself uh, adding to the, uh, to the squad. Uh, so yeah, just let me know that down in the comment section and you know with likes and we can see if we can get that up for you guys uh, Today as well. I feel like I'm rambling and going and uh, in this video uh, Definitely appreciate you uh, you you find folks out there in YouTube land uh, anybody that's new to the channel Definitely hit that subscribe button uh, Also uh, check me out on twitch. That's linked down in the description. I'm starting to live stream more uh, Check me out on Twitter. That's linked down in the description you know, if you guys uh, enjoy the video, definitely share my videos on Twitter and whatnot. Uh, also, check me out on my walkthrough channel. That's linked down in the description. Head over to my walkthrough channel. Check some videos out. If you guys like what you see, subscribe to that channel as well. Other than that, y'all already know what it is, man. It's your boy Cooper. Go live.